going on, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe. Also, if you guys are enjoying today's workout, hit that thumbs up. That way I know you guys like it. Today I'm wearing this lovely blue tank top, and that means upper body day. Today we're going to be doing a body weight and dumbbell workout routine consisting of 40 second long intervals for each exercise. During the week, I will post this one up on Monday. Wednesday, I will also post up another workout for lower body. And then again, at the end of the week, it'll be a combined upper and lower. So stay tuned for those extra videos coming out. But until then, let's get that warm up in. Okay, if you guys are ready, let's get that warm up in. Now remember, my warm ups, I do two sets. If you all need a bit more warm up, do three. But, if you guys are ready, let's get that first one in. In, three, two, and go. Now remember, with this cat cow, you guys have done it. Quite a few times. We're just working on that mobility. Try and get that back spinal area moving. Don't worry about going fast just yet. This one, you're just trying to warm it up. I'm not trying to jump at all. Uh, I don't really do jumping exercises too often. I just want you to warm up those shoulders, warm up that back some more. Get the heart rate up a little bit, yeah? Again, in three, two, and go. Alright, 
So again, for those of you that don't feel quite warmed up yet, get that third set in. After you get that in, let's get that workout. Take about a 30 second rest period. Uh, hydrate, get some water if you need it. And I'll see you guys in that first group of exercises. Alright, now that everybody's warmed up and you've possibly had some water on your little 30 second break, let's go ahead and get that first group of exercises in. So remember these exercises are going to be 40 seconds long. Don't go fast through the exercise, just take your time. It's all about control. Going up on down in 3, 2, and go. So same as that warm up, you're going to start in that plank position. You guys are keeping your abs tight, glutes are tight. You guys are coming across, tapping those shoulders. You're going to feel it going side to side on you, which is exactly what you want. But you want to keep that body and those hips flat and straight. Don't let them rock back and forth. Flat on your stomach. In three, two, and go. Just squeeze that back. Bring it up. Squeeze. And just take your time with it. Nice steady pace going. Good. 
Fall down flat on your stomach. In three, two, and go. Nice steady pace. Don't rush through it.
Hopefully you had enough time with water real quick. But now we're on to that second group. So let's get after it. First up, hop on down. In three, two, and go. With this exercise, it's very important to keep that chest right over the hands. I don't want you guys up here doing presses in your shoulders. Come down, basically keep the middle of your chest, right in the middle of your palms. Take your time with this exercise, you don't need to go fast. Backs. 
in three, two, and go. Nice steady pace. Concentrate on how you're pressing. Your body's not 
turning side to side. Keep a little relax. Shoulder press down. You want to raise up. Nice steady pace. Not too fast. You feel you've got this exercise down. Face up. Don't lose four. That boy's down. Next exercise. Okay. Three, two, and up. My level ones consist of a bent knee placed in right in front of the other leg. Don't put it on top, that's level two. Level one, hit that side up. All right here should be tight. Shoulders should be working. Hand on the hip, hand on the air, grab your pump a little bit. Alright. Let's go and switch sides. In three, two, and go. Shoulders should be tired a little bit by now. If you feel your weight is too heavy, lighter. I don't mind coming down and resting. Pop back up, remember? We're just working on form. Getting you used to correcting your shoulder tight. Press shoulders, lats tight. Good. Relax it. Timer. Three, two, and Sag, take it back up again. If you're paying the elbows too much, 
pounds on each elbow. And apply a little more pad in there. Alright, relax. Uh, and if I didn't explain before, this last set I'm trying something a little different. Instead of watching the standard 30 seconds, I'm going to give you guys 30 seconds. Let me know which ones you guys like better. to a minute break and I will see you for the stretch. Oh, 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 
hip flexor with the side oblique stretch. Okay. So we're pushing the hip. I want you guys to reach up. Time first. In three, two, and go. I want you to turn a little bit. I want you to reach across. Reach. I want you to feel this stretch. You guys have a wall? Have a wall. Reach into it. Deep breaths. Big deep breaths. Good. So let's switch sides.